Hey guys, we're in uh, beautiful Irvine. What's the name of this course, Troy? Strawberry Farms. Strawberry Farms. And we are at the Mike Thompson RV Golf Tournament. It's their annual golf tournament. This is one of the most beautiful golf courses in Southern California. I got to tell you, um, you've played this many a times. I have. Yeah, it's like a 6,700 yards, par 71, in the canyons, lots of wildlife. You got to know how to play this course because I'll go through at least a box. I don't mean a sleeve. <laughs> I mean, a box of balls when I play here, but Mike Thompson puts on a hell of an event. They've, they got great prizes, a lot of great people, good food. It's a, it's a really fun time. Mike Thompson's, when they do stuff like this, they do it right. Yeah. Just like this beautiful bus behind us. Uh, when you're in the market for an RV, you got to go check them out. But today, um, shooter on the roof, right? <laughs> yeah. We're sitting here broadcasting right next to the clubhouse. Yeah. We see two guys up on the roof right now, so it's making us think. When's the last time we heard about a shooter on the roof? Yeah, and I'm not a conspiracy guy, but I'm going to tell you that uh, when I saw that video of the sheriff's department, and they the, the guy, is he's got the body cam on, and he's talking to his buddies, and he told the Secret Service, you need to be on these roofs, and they went through the whole meeting, and... How does a 20-year-old kid who's been visited but more than 20 times by the FBI before the shooting pull this off? Yeah, this it, Thomas Crooks character, right? He's, yeah. He's 20 years old. He, he scoots up onto a roof. He's, he's, the, he's at the event like an hour beforehand flying a drone over the top. I'm not a conspiracy guy at all. Hammer, it. he said he's not, but he, he's got that much in him. I know he does. But the fact that they didn't have, the FBI didn't have somebody up on that roof taking care of shit just shocks me. I'm going to tell you for a fact there's no way, there's no way that the government didn't know this was going down. I mean, I don't care what side of the political aisle you're on. They've tried to, I don't care if you're Republican, Democrat, Independent, it's just not right. You don't, they tried to impeach him, they tried to the criminal justice system against him, then they tried to assassinate this guy. Well, well it, start, it starts moving away from our democratic society, which is what we're so proud of. Completely. Right, yeah. You and, know, and I'm the same way. You know, I don't care who you vote for, I don't care which political party care. you're with the way to resolve things is not with a high powered rifle in any any circumstance unless of course you're big game hunting in utah yeah but guys i mean seriously where is our politics gone and you know we don't discuss politics i mean it's just something we try that not we, to, yeah. we, we don't want to get into that rat race yeah. um that's all about clickbait but um it's just sad to me that we're at this point because i'm proud of this country but i want it to be fair and honest you know but our you know, our media is not fair and honest anymore. And no, every time, you know, see MSNBC, CNN, whatever you watch, you have to remember which channel you're on because every one of them has a slant. What happened to Walter Cronkite for Christ's sake? Oh, know? my God. Give me it straightforward. That's you, the news. You, That's the way it is. You know, and guys, I know this is right la uh, leaning, but like Candace Owens and people like that, they just tell the truth. If you just tell us the truth, it, if it hurts, it hurts. And we're big, you know, we're big people. We yeah. wear our big panties. We can handle it. We can, you know, work on the differences from there. I'd right. like to actually put a, you know, to your watchers and listeners here. To, let's hear your comments on what you think there's a conspiracy there. If you feel our democracy is kind of folding, I, we'd love to hear your comments on that. Absolutely, guys. And listen, I don't, you know, once again, uh, we're not even going to tell you what our affiliation is. But it, the, the point is, is that. It's in it's, here. That's yeah, our affiliation. It's, it's in here. But it's got to be fair and balanced. And yeah. we need to get back to, hey, let's have a fair, let's have a fair vote and a, a democracy that works. Guys, tell us what you think. Catch you next time.